On today's movie recap, we see a special type of pill that can make one have superpowers. Stay with us as unravel this mystery. A group of drug traffickers in a near future version of New Orleans, including one named Newt, receive a free supply of power pills, which give them various superpowers for five minutes. The distributor is unknown. Six weeks later, consumers after power almost rob Newt's teenage cousin Robin, who works as a dealer herself. One of her frequent buyers, in OPD officer Frank Shaver, comes to her rescue. Searching for the distributor Biggie, Art finds Newt, who overdoses, on power, and dies in a battle. Frank stops a thief with enhanced power from robbing a bank, but he gets suspended for using power himself. His captain provides Frank with a photo of the man they believe to be the drug supplier and discloses that officials are urging him to end any inquiry into power, Art. Art makes Robin accompany him to the safe house of the drug cartel after he uses Newt's phone to locate and kidnap Robin. After being shot while taking down multiple cartel members, he finds out that power users in New Orleans are being watched as drug test subjects. As they tend to Robin's wounds, Art becomes closer to him and tells him that, following his discharge from the army, he was hired by Taleos, a private defense contractor, who used him as a test subject for superpowers. After the trials, his daughter, Tracy, showed abilities without ever using the medication, and Wallace, a Teleos agent, kidnapped her. When Art and Robin get there, Biggie is in the vicinity of the Superdome, where throngs of saints supporters are making their way for a home game, holding a private demonstration of Project Power for a prospective buyer. Biggie asserts that power is the next evolution of the human species, citing the wolverine frog and chameleon as examples of creatures whose skills the pill mimics. Frank steps in after tracking other users to the demonstration, stopping Art when he interrogates. Biggie at gunpoint and discovers information about a ship called the Genesis. After Biggie consumes some power, Art, Robin, and Frank are forced to escape while Biggie is exploded to death by Art. Art explains that Tracy is the source of the drug's powers and that the power outbreak in New Orleans is mass testing to stabilize the drug before Frank captures him and notifies his commander. Art deliberately has himself arrested by Taleos and transported aboard the Genesis after, persuading Frank that his captain is actually receiving commands from Taleos. Art convinces a guard to release him as Frank and Robin sneak into the ship. Wallace is killed by Frank and Art, and Tracy is found and brought back to her father by Robin. Dr. Gardner, the leader of Project Power, captures Robin as the four try to escape and demands Tracy in return for Robin's life. Art approaches Gardner and reveals that power grants him the strength of a gun shrimp. He then utilizes this power to eliminate Gardner and her soldiers and save Robin. Tracy uses her own powers to bring Art back to life after he loses it due to using his power, and they all manage to leave the ship. While Art chooses to move on, Frank plans to expose Project Power to the media. He tells Robin to use the greatness within her and gives her his truck and a bag full of cash to pay for her mother's medical expenses. Tracy and Art finally go free at last. Robin, meantime, embarks on a new career as a rapper. If you enjoyed this video, please do well to like, comment what movies you want us to review next, and subscribe to our channel. Also, don't forget to turn on the notification bell icon to get notified whenever we upload new contents.